Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having a fantastic day. I know I have been gone for a while. I haven't posted an, a video in like a week or a week and a half and I'm so sorry about that. I've just been incredibly busy and um, I finally had the time to sit down and film a video for you guys. So today's video is going to be a haul, um, just a mini haul video on some new stuff I've gone recently. Not anything too exciting, um, but I just wanted to sit down and share these new products with you guys. So I do have a mix of uh, drugstore and uh, Sephora, like high-end products in this video. So I'm very excited to share them with you guys. So let's just get right on into the haul video. Okay, let's start with the drugstore products I've gotten recently. So I just picked up a bunch of these Wet n Wild First Gel Lip Liners. This is what they look like. Like, and I'm actually wearing one right now in the shade a bear to comment um, and this is one I've had for quite a while now but I decided to pick up the rest of the collection so I will be doing a lip swatch video um, and review very very soon if you guys are interested let me know and I will for sure film that for you guys because I really like the formula on these lip liners and now that I have all the shades I think it's appropriate to film a lip swatch video um, if you guys have been watching me for a while you know that I do film a lot of lip swatch videos here on my channel and lip product reviews. Speaking of lip liners, I actually did purchase another line of lip liners. Now these are the Maybelline Color Sensational lip liners and I did grab every single shade in the collection. So if you guys want, I will also do a lip swatch video on these ones right here. Um, there's actually also like a clear lip liner and I do have one from Rimmel as well. I might do like a testing out like these invisible lip liner um type videos if you guys are interested i'll definitely do that for you because i think it's a cool product to test out but i'm really excited about this maybelline formula too i've actually never tried this formula out i've tried the maybelline like twistable um lip liners but not like their sharpenable ones so i'm very very excited to try these out as well next thing i picked up is a drugstore palette and this is the elf everyday smoky eyeshadow palette now um i have tried a bunch of elf palettes in the past i have their prism palettes i have um their mad for matte palettes which you guys know i already love but i realized i've never actually tried any of their other palettes um so i decided to pick up their everyday smoky palette i'll show you guys what it looks like so this is the palette right here. I have used this palette like once, but I haven't used it enough to actually get like a full opinion on it. So I will use it some more. It's just like a nice neutral smoky palette. So I'm very excited to use it some more and get a full opinion on it. If you guys want a review video on this, I will definitely do that for you guys. Or if you want a review video on anything in this video today, let me know and I will for sure film that. Next thing I got is actually a makeup tool and this is the Eco Tools Perfecting Blender Duo and this is um, two sponges so I've heard a lot of people rave about the Eco Tools sponge and I finally picked it up just because um, everyone was talking about it. I haven't heard much about this little one right here but the pack I got did come with both of them so I'm very very excited about this and I'm very very excited to try it out. Um, I've been discovering a bunch of like drugstore um, beauty sponges like the Morphe one I've been loving um, the L'Oreal one is amazing so I'm very very excited to try out this Eco Tool sponge I might do like a first impressions or something on it all right now let's get into some of the things I picked up from Sephora um, you guys know that here on my channel I do mostly stick to drugstore products so I did get some things from the drugstore but I also picked up a few goodies from Sephora it was Black Friday recently so they had some pretty good deals the first thing I got is actually a glow kit from Anastasia Beverly Hills, and this is the Aurora glow kit. I am so excited to try this out, and I'm so excited to play around with it some more and maybe review it for you guys. Uh, this is what it looks like on the inside. I have already swatched the shades, but they're beautiful, and I can't wait to play around with these colorful highlighters. I actually used this shade right here on my lid for the shimmer shade, and I really, really liked it. So I'm excited to actually use this on my face as highlighters. Um, and yeah, I think the packaging on this is gorgeous and the shades are gorgeous and I really wanted to pick this up since I don't have anything like it. I have a ton of highlighters as you guys know, but not so many like colorful ones like in this palette. Like I'm super excited for the peach shades, the purple, the blue, the green. Like I'm so excited to use this on my face, on my eyes, like just to use it in general. And yeah, so um, really excited that I picked that up. 
Next thing I got from Sephora is actually another eyeshadow palette. So this is the Huda Beauty Warm Brown Obsessions palette. Now she recently just came out with a bunch of these little palettes. I believe there's four, um, but this one really caught my eye. I wonder why it's full of warm tone shadows. I use some of them today on my eye, but I'm really excited to play around with it some more and maybe give you guys a review and swatch video. I love all the warm, rich shades in this and I'm so excited to start playing around with this gold shade right in the middle there. It looks like such a promising palette. I'm really excited about it. It was around $35 I believe which I think is actually pretty good for like a high-end palette um, and you do get nine shades in here which is nice. So yeah I'm very excited about this and I can't wait to use it especially with like the holidays coming up. And the last thing I got at Sephora is actually one of those like gift with purchases. You know, I had some points lying around, so I decided to use it. And they actually had this Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick in the shade Besso. So I picked up this right here and I'm excited to use it. I love these little like lip deluxe sample sizes, um, especially for like liquid lipsticks and stuff. I think they're really nice just because I have so many. I'm never going to go through like a full tube of lipstick, but this is the one that stood out to me the most. And I think the red color is perfect for Christmas and the holiday season coming up. So I'm excited to try this out. So that is it for my haul video today, guys. I know it was like a pretty mini haul, but I did want to share some of the things I got recently with you guys. So hopefully you enjoyed. Um, I'm sorry again that I've been gone for so long, but videos are coming back very very soon I promise but yeah I hope you guys are having a fantastic day thank you so much for watching please subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in my next video bye guys